It is very cold. And Mr. Gupta and Sharma went to a shop to buy a heater. The shopkeeper showed them two heaters. One was cheap and the other was expensive. The design on this one looks much better than the other and the power rating is the same for both which means the electricity bill will be the same. So what if it's a little expensive? Let's get this one. But Mr. Sharma saw the power rating of both and bought the cheaper one. Ah, Mr. Sharma, you picked up the cheaper one just to save a little money, huh? We will only use it for two hours daily and we will save a little on the electricity bill. But voltage for the both is same. He won't understand it this way. When the electricity bill comes at the end of the month, that's when I'll explain it to him. Mr. Gupta also started using his heater for just two hours a day. And after the month ended, he went to Mr. Sharma with his electricity bill. Look at this. Even after using the heater for two hours every day, the bill for the month is only 2,000 rupees. But mine is only 1650. Hi, how did this happen? Even though they have the same voltage, how is my electricity bill higher? Mr. Gupta, if you want to save electricity on an equipment, don't see the voltage, see its power rating. But why? Electricity bill depends on total energy consumption, which is power multiplied by time. Power depends on an equipment's voltage as well as its current and resistance. One unit of electricity is equal to 1 kilowatt hour. Mr. Gupta's heater is 2000 watts. So in one hour, it will consume 2 kilowatts hours of energy, which means 2 units. On the other hand, Mr. Sharma's heater is 1000 watts. So it consumes 1 unit of electricity in one hour. That means more the power, the higher the bill. Now a furious Mr. Gupta went back to the shopkeeper. The heater you gave me, it made my electricity bill shoot up. Oh Mr. Gupta, it has this knob right here. You can change the power from 800 watts to 2000 watts. 